Hello, what's the crack? What's the story? Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Today we're checking out some lovely and some beautiful, sexy. Can I say sexy? <laughs> yeah, let's say sexy. <laughs> sexy Billy Connolly. This is the worst pain known to man. Ah, uh, the worst pain known to man for me probably getting kicked in the balls. I'd say that that's so that's really so obviously women say it's more soft giving birth but again you have to, it's something that you have to experience to actually know how you should feel but yeah let's go There's, i touched a stonefish one day i was stonefish. extremely brave what is that it was in a wee cave thing on some coral you know it wasn't being that's normal hello <laughs> i'm a stone you can stand in me if you like <laughs> <Stonefish>. <laughs> I'm a particularly comfortable stone. I a stand. But, but up here, it's okay. You know, it's got these barbs on its back that'll do you. But again, up here, it's fine. And it looks, it's a most pleasant looking animal. It's like the drummer in the Muppets. You know that mad fucking... <laughs> it's, it's all like seaweed. And you can tickle it and fart around and it's a pleasant little creature. But if you stand on it, fuck. Now, Apparently, it's the worst pain known mm. to man. How did you know this? I don't know. Somebody must have said, I stood in one of them once. How was it? Worst fucking pain known to man. <laughs> <laughs> Have you known a lot of pain? Huh? Yeah. Fell off my bike once. <laughs> But the word, word has it, it's the worst pain known to man. And uh, I'm, sure, I'm sure there's, a, there's a, a, a device of some kind that measures things like that. There's some kind of pain. meter. Do you know what? It goes from ouch. I feel like when people say all this kind of stuff, I feel like it depends on the person. It depends. Like I could stand on it and it could, it could be really sore, but then I could just think of something else that was sore. Like when I think of soreness, is probably... Like now, I play a lot of football, and sometimes I could literally just bend my finger. I remember I bent my finger like a few weeks ago. And mate, it was so so. It's something you don't think of. But when it happens to you, like all it takes is like a little flicker. And like, oh, oh. To me, that's a lot of pain. So it depends on you know who you are and what what you classify as pain. Do you know what I mean? Let me know what you guys think is the worst pain. No, or maybe even just banging your toe on the door. That could be the worst pain known to man. You know. Right, right into, what the fuck was that? <laughs> Jesus Christ is the next one. Going up like that, you know. Sweet fucking mother of Jesus, what the fuck was that? Right, right through agony to worst pain known to man. <laughs> I think it's a German device. <laughs> People instantly believe you. Uh, it wouldn't be German. Uh, <laughs> It's the fucking steam meter, it's called. And the <laughs> fuck! <laughs> just spat all over myself. So, <laughs> I, know, I don't know how they test them, these meters. Maybe the guys who made it tested it. Well, I'll, I'll, t I'll test it up to ouch, okay? Ouch. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake! Oh, I went past ouch right to, oh, for fuck's sake there. Oh, for fuck's sake, oh, that's, that's it, that's it. How are we going to test it up to, oh, fuck, I don't know. I know what we'll do, we'll get a simpleton from the village. <laughs> Come here, simpleton from the village. <laughs> oh, you won't. Right, we're going to be swimming and doing science. And you're the very man. Ooh, aye, come on. Okay. Right, you take the meter. Okay. Splosh. He's meant to be underwater, he's doing that that well, I'm believing it. Obviously he's pretending to be underwater, how the person would sound like. He's doing his... Wait, actually, did he ever act? Let me know, did Billy Connolly ever do any TV shows or movies? He'd be a good actor. 
What? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Another, another beautiful Billy Connolly sketch. Again, what I say I like about him is the fact that he makes you picture the scene and it's so relatable. He's so, so relatable. Yeah, you guys let me know what a Billy Connolly story you want to check out. I've only just started checking out Billy Connolly a few weeks ago, so I've seen loads of good stuff and I want to keep seeing them. Yeah, in case you see any copyright stuff, you know, for YouTube, check out Patreon. You want to see without the copyright stuff or you want to see stuff earlier. Support the channel. It's good for the channel as well. Yeah, make sure you like, subscribe, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.